What is going on guys, it's your mom Phoenix Nice back for another video. So as of now, Roblox does not support side mouse buttons and the reason is simply because the majority of players don't have those extra buttons. So I'm guessing they probably don't want to dedicate their resources to pushing out an update that benefits such a small portion of the player base. So you're probably watching this video today because uh, Strucid requires a lot of keybinds as you can see here. And your keyboard only has a limited number of keys that's within comfortable reaching distance of your left hand. So today I'm going to be showing you how you can bind your side mouse buttons to your Strucid keybinds. And this technique works for any game, not just Strucid. Alright, so the first step is to open up your mouse program. Um, for me, I'm using a Razer Death Adder, so my program is called Razer Synapse. Now you want to choose the side button that you're using for your keybind. So for me, I'm going to be using mouse button 4 for placing down spike traps and bouncers. So click on mouse button 4. And then for button assignment, choose keyboard function. And now you want to bind the key to a key that you're not currently using. So for me, I'm going to be choosing N. And then you press save. Now open up Strucid and press on keybinds. And then find the mouse function that you're binding to. So for me, I'm looking for trap. And then for the key, um, bind it to the key that you just set. So for me, it's N. And now whenever you press your side mouse button, it should press down on the N key, which should place down a trap for you. Okay, so now we're inside a Strucid match. Okay, this is new map, by the way, if you guys haven't seen it already. It's pretty freaking awesome. So I know you can't see my keyboard, but maybe you can hear my mouse button clicking. But uh, see, when I click my mouse button, this spike trap pops up. And... Oh, got on voice. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you found this useful, please share it with your friends so that they know how to bind their side mouse buttons as well. See you guys next time.